Indeed, as far as Mumbai is concerned, where uh, Southwest Monsoon made its entry yesterday and it entered with a bang. When we talk about Mumbai, water logging has been reported from various parts. Monsoon uh, has, uh, you know, brought in a heavy rainfall and that has resulted in flooding in various parts. We're talking about low-lying areas that have been flooded in the city. Uh, rain and gusty winds were reported along with uh, thunderstorms uh, as far as the city of Mumbai is concerned. Now, a red alert warning has been issued by the Met Office for Konkan and Goa and Q including Mumbai as well as Madhya Maharashtra over the coming 24 hours. Uh, tomorrow that category is going to be reduced to orange alert, but that still means heavy to very heavy showers are expected in the state, uh, in the city of uh, Mumbai and in the areas, uh, uh, joining areas including Madhya Maharashtra, Konkan and Goa as well as uh, going all the way up till Karnataka. Well, also uh, in the coming 48 hours, heavy showers are expected in Mumbai. We have my colleague Anuj joining us from the Bandra uh, station in Mumbai. Uh, Anuj, take us through how bad is the situation on the ground. I mean, uh, water logging uh, reports are flooding in uh, from various parts of Mumbai. Uh, yes, water logging has become a problem here in Mumbai, especially since midnight yesterday. Uh, yesterday midnight saw the arrival of rainfalls in Mumbai city. And mind you, this is still the pre-monsoon conditions as far as Mumbai is concerned. Uh, now here, at the moment, we are present on the eastern, at the eastern entrance of the Bandra railway station here in Mumbai. And as you can see in front of me, there has already been water logging issues. People are traveling to work in the morning. It is 9 a.m. They're moving out to work and they're finding it difficult to make their way out to, to the station. Now, this is just one of the several places in the city which have been affected because of water logging. There are other important places such as Kurla, Dahisar, and of course, regions in Dadar, which have also been affected due to water logging. It has not just affected locals in traveling within the city, but even long distance travels in a way have become difficult because uh, there have been several messages and tweets been put out on several social media platforms asking people to not take the uh, the important routes while traveling to Thane because there has been a traffic, uh, you know, traffic is quite stuck in major places on major roads which connect Mumbai and Thane. Uh, there, have, uh, there have been several complaints as far as the BMC is considered where people are saying that important projects and important roads were dug up right before the pre-monsoon uh, season began in Mumbai, which shows the preparedness of the city as far as monsoon is considered. Because uh, just last week, the PMC and the government of Maharashtra reassured the people of Maharashtra, or especially Mumbai, that, uh, uh, that the rains were not going to cause as much as havoc as they did last year uh, in, in this particular part of the country. But it's just the pre-monsoon which arrived yesterday midnight, and that has shown the loopholes in the system uh, now, IMD has said that the rainfall, the officially the rainfall in the city is supposed to arrive in the next 48 hours. Every but, year, uh, Mumbai and uh, rainfall Anush, arrives. Actually, uh, according to the Met Office, uh, monsoon season has begun as of yesterday in Mumbai and that's going to continue. And according to them, they're warning of very heavy showers. So it's day one of the monsoon season. And there you can see, uh, you know, roads uh, being uh, flooded, uh, resembling uh, rivers as far as Mumbai is concerned. And it's just the first day as far as the monsoon is concerned. And usually monsoon arrives in Mumbai on the 11th of this month. And it's coming two days before time on the 9th of June is when monsoon has made its entry into Mumbai. But do remember that it reached Kerala also two days in advance. So the progress that we are seeing as far as the west coast of the monsoon is concerned is progressing, uh, you know, even before time. But in the northeastern part of the country, the monsoon hasn't moved at all, in fact, from the 31st of May. But it's covered the ground that it should have by now. So uh, as far as the monsoon is concerned, it's moving on track. But it is, it has, uh, you know, uh, entered Mumbai with a bang, with quite a vengeance there. And, uh, you know, from what we are hearing is a red alert warning has been sounded off. Very heavy showers to continue over the next 48 hours.